Hi, I'm Mohan Atreya, VP of Products and Solutions at Rafi Systems. In this video, we will learn a little more about Amazon's newly launched EKS Distro, also known as EKSD. We will also look at what it looks like to provision and manage the lifecycle of Amazon EKSD Distro-based Kubernetes clusters using the Rafi platform. So what is Amazon's EKS Distro? It is essentially upstream Kubernetes that is leveraged and used by Amazon's EKS. And EKSD allows organizations to create reliable and secure Kubernetes clusters using the same versions of Kubernetes that are used by Amazon EKS. So the benefits are you can standardize on the same distribution as you might use on your Amazon EKS clusters, but also use them for non-AWS environments. Every EKSD release follows Amazon's rigorous process for verifying new Kubernetes versions to ensure compatibility and stability. In addition, Amazon also provides extended support for Kubernetes versions long after the community support for upstream Kubernetes for that particular version expires. So how do you provision and manage Amazon EKSD-based Kubernetes clusters? Well, uh, this is where Rafi's managed Kubernetes platform can help. Rafi MKP is an open Kubernetes platform that enables users to use your preferred Kubernetes distribution. MKP provides both a declarative as well as an imperative wizard-based approach to automate the provisioning and ongoing lifecycle management of Kubernetes clusters. It does more than this, but more on that later. And now we've added support for Amazon's EKS Distro. So let's look at what the experience looks like for a user to provision EKSD on bare metal and virtual machine-based environments. In addition to a declarative GitOps-driven cluster provisioning approach, Rafi also supports an imperative wizard-based approach that makes it easy for users to operationalize Amazon EKSD-based clusters in seconds. Simply choose the environment and the Amazon EKS Distro, provide a name for the cluster and follow instructions to provision the cluster in minutes. You can also use Rafi to provision Amazon EKSD on Google and Azure public cloud environments. Let's look at what that experience looks like. So simply select the public cloud environment and select GCP for Google and choose Amazon's EKS Distro. If you want to deploy the EKSD cluster on Azure, select Azure, and select Amazon EKS Distro, and follow the step-by-step -step process to provision the cluster. But well, once the cluster is provisioned, how do you have visibility and monitoring of the EKSD Kubernetes clusters? Well, once the cluster is provisioned, uh, Rafi provides deep visibility and monitoring of the Kubernetes clusters. Um, multiple dashboards are available that administrators can use to navigate into uh, the cluster details. For example, we're looking at the cluster dashboard for an EKSD-based Kubernetes cluster running in a non-AWS environment. You can also look at uh, dashboards for the Kubernetes resources and be able to navigate deep into a pod or a container um, in seconds using the Rafi console. And learn more about how you can provision and manage Amazon EKSD based Kubernetes clusters in any environment. Navigate to Rafi's website, rafi.co, to learn more, or go to our docs at docs.rafi.co. You can also sign up for a free trial on the indicated URL. And if you would like to see a demo of this in action and learn more, reach out to us at info at Thank you.